early on, um, I, you know, when you're not necessarily going looking for a new job if you love the job you're doing and you're be being given a lot of opportunity. And so early in my career, I had a lot of great opportunities. And because General Motors is such a large company, it's like I can look and say, I've probably had seven careers at General Motors. When I look at the fact I've run a, a run a assembly plan, I've been the head of uh, of HR, I've been a senior leader in communications, had the opportunity to work for the chairman and the vice chairman on special projects earlier in my career. So as you have that opportunity to, to keep growing and learning and feeling like you're challenged, it, you know, you're, not, you're not really paying attention to other opportunities because you, you love what you're doing. Uh, as you know, the company went on, had harder times, and I was probably in the mid-20s of uh, 20 years being there. It was, it, for me, it was making a personal decision of, I, I've been here for a long enough time, I know what this company's capable of doing and being, and I know so many people in the company that are great, dedicated people, and I wanna be a part of turning it around. And so that's what kept me there uh, in the, you know, as we went through the restructuring, never knowing I would have the opportunity to have this job, but it just became um, important to me to do that. And I would also say, um, having been at the company for so long, we've had people who have left the industry and they want to come back and, you know, they'll say there's just nothing like the auto industry. If you think about it, um, you know, putting a car and truck in a, a car or a truck or an SUV on the road, how people make the decision. I get people <clears throat> sending me emails where they name their vehicles, or they'll tell me that you know their Tahoe took them through you know ten years of their life, and including being treated for cancer, and, and they, uh, you know, those kinds of things. You you really get to connect with your customer, and it's a hard industry but it's an exciting industry. It's, it's, it's got a bit of fashion, it's got tech. Again, um, it's got this really interesting relationship with the customer. And I find even people who have left the industry, they wanna come back. So, uh, and, and also I'm second generation, so I think a little of it was in my blood.